JJ Redick, a trade finally goes down here. We've heard rumors the last couple weeks that the Pelicans had enough of Redick and wanted to ship him off, and they definitely do here today, trading him and Nico Mealy to the Dallas Mavericks in a deal for Wes Edu, J James Johnson, and a future second round pick. So, a lot of second round picks traded today in the NBA in the trade deadline. And this has probably been the busiest deadline that I can remember in the last few seasons. On the season, J.J. Redick, 8.7 points a game, 1.7 rebounds, 1.3 assists, 1.6 threes a game. An amazing 95% from the foul line this season and 40% from the field. But Redick here, he just didn't get the playing time. And him and Stan Van Gundy just didn't see eye to eye. But now Dallas... They're trying to make the playoffs. They needed another shooter to surround Luka Doncic and Kristaps Porzingis. And I think Reddick's the perfect guy to put into that starting lineup or even have him come off the bench and play a major role. So it's a good move here for Dallas. And in my opinion, they didn't give much in terms of players or draft picks. Second round picks are usually busts in the NBA and only a few guys make the league and make an impact. And Nico Mealy, he's not going to do much for this Dallas team. It was just a deal to match up salaries and add depth to both teams. So Mealy on the season, two points a game, 2.6 rebounds. And he's a guy who hasn't played much at all for New Orleans. And I expect the same here for him with the Dallas Mavericks. And now James Johnson, he's been a journeyman throughout his career in the NBA. But he's last on defense Hustle and toughness, but James Johnson, another guy, he's not going to have fantasy value in New Orleans. 5.7 points a game, 3 rebounds, 1.7 assists, 58% from the foul line, and 46% from the field. So he'll only probably play 10-15 minutes at most, if that, for the Pelicans. But the big winner in the fantasy basketball land is Alexander Walker. He's going to play a ton of minutes now, I believe, with J.J. Redick out of town. Lonzo Ball, we thought was going to get traded because he's a free agent as well after the season, but the Pelicans held on to him. But this is a good deal for Dallas. I like it a lot, and they're going to make out good with this one, getting a veteran like Redick who's been through the wars and the playoffs, and he's going to hit a shot and make the most of it. And Redick, he should be picked up in most fantasy leagues now because I think he'll play anywhere from 25 to 30 minutes a game. So J.J. Redick traded to the Dallas Mavericks, and we'll see what he does now with his new team and if he'll have any fantasy value in the lasting weeks of the fantasy basketball season.